Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to another video in this series of what sold. As always, I provide the same information, what the product is, what it sold for, what the shipping price was, what I paid for it, and because of one of you viewers requested it, I'm also gonna include how long it took for it to sell. So let's go. And as I do, let's start with my own product because it is proudly designed in Texas, made in the USA. Eclipse glasses. Don't forget, October 14th, which is next Saturday, the Eclipse, the first Eclipse, the annular one, is going to be up and going. So if you want glasses, you got to get them now. If not, you're not going to get them in time. This week, the sales ramped up because, of course, the date is getting closer and closer. So I sold 340 units of these. The 5-pack going for $14.39, 10-pack $17.99, 15-pack, which is new, I just added this, $26.27, 20-pack, also new, $33.92, $39.95 for the 25-pack, 50-pack for $79.91, and 100-pack for $134.99. I'm so proud of these, and it's going to be so fun to go look at the Eclipse on the 14th. And one of the other products that you guys see every single week is Aussie Volume Hairspray. I have about a bin and a half left, so let's just call it about 60 or 70 units. This week I sold 13 bottles, the three pack going for $29.69 on average, and then a four pack going for $33.99 on average. Whenever you see discontinued product that you know will sell, buy it all up. Here we have a pipe stand for two pipes. It's from Decatur Industries. It's made in the USA and it's genuine walnut. This was part of my death pile that I had just left behind for a while. I bought it for a dollar and it sold for $19.79, $6.99 shipping. And it sold within one day. Here we got the imaginative board game. Sealed new. Bought this for two bucks, sold it for $25.19 free shipping, and it took only 1.5 months to sell. Here we have the GoPro Session. This is the first session that came out. It's the square camera that you just press at the top. You pretty much, it doesn't have an LCD screen other than the right there, just to tell you that it's recording. And I have it with this case. I didn't buy this. This was actually mine. I used it for a long time. And as soon as I put this up, within two days, it sold for 68 bucks. I took an offer. I had it up for 73. Took an offer for $68, $9.99 shipping. Electronics like these, especially from GoPro, do really well. I know that there's other cameras like DJI and people always buy the Chinese crap. You know what? I have bought a plenty of cameras and they all suck compared to GoPro. That's why they cost more. So if you're out looking for an action camera, just spend the money. These are calligraphy pens, pack of two. I got these at Hobby Lobby for 50 cents each. They sold for $13.49 free shipping and it took two months to sell. This is a camel. This has camel sleeves. It's got the US flag on the side. It's got the long horn in the front. Almost anything Texas sells super fast. I put this up and then when the three days sold for $17, $9.99 shipping and I bought it for two bucks. Mountain Dew hat. This is a very cool hat that sold, it used to sell for $19.99. I got this for $1, sold it for $13.49 and it took nine months to sell. Vera Bradley. These are water or rain boots. The tag is right here and the tag actually goes there to, to hang which I will throw in there when I when I ship them out. I got these for $15, sold for 35 free shipping. This is the last one, so I just wanted to take a, I took an offer for 35 bucks and I sold through them. It took five months to sell out on all of these. I got these at Kohl's, so you can always pick these up after season is over. You can pick these up for almost nothing, especially when they have that additional 50% off uh, sale. Monopoly socks. I love these. I actually have a pair of these for myself. These took three months to sell through almost all of them. I only have two pairs left. These I got at Burlington for two bucks. Sold for $10.79 free shipping. And these are basically a forever product because I can always find these. These are going to be also a great product for Christmas because you can put them in stockings. These are great gifts or it could even be a gag gift for someone. I'm not gonna put that up there because it's unnecessary. These are Uline tubes. They are the poster tubes. If you notice right here, they're two by 25 or two by 24. 
I got the I got a bunch of these boxes when a company was going out of business. This is what they used to ship out their products. And I bought this. When I bought all the boxes, it ended up being about three bucks per box of these. So I sold this for $70.37. I took an offer for $70.37 free shipping. And I only bought them. I like I said, I only paid three bucks. The shipping on this is gonna be high especially because it's going to new york but most of the other ones that i've sold have been really low about 25 dollars in shipping this was going to be about 45 so i'm going to make a lot less but profit nonetheless i have maybe 10 boxes of these left and they do sell quite a bit to obviously to resellers or to other people that have businesses that need tubes like this for protection check out the bags vampire i don't know i don't know how to do it like a cat I purchased these for 10 bucks. I mean, 10 cents, 10 cents each bag after Halloween last year. I didn't put them up until about a month ago. So these took a month to sell, but I did sell them for $10.97 free shipping. They weigh nothing. So this is probably gonna be a, under four ounces. Great profit. And I still have about 200 bags left. Normally Halloween stuff does really well. These are cheap and I get it. You know, they have the tag one, $1.74 right there. Doesn't matter. They still sell really well and they sell pretty fast. Here we got two train insulators. These are ceramic. So they're gonna be a little hard to ship. I gotta, I gotta make sure that they don't break on the way. But I got these for $1.50 each. Sold them for $16, $15 shipping and it took 2.5 months to sell. So two and a half months, not bad. I personally like stuff like this. I know it didn't bring in a lot of money, but I like selling it because somebody will really appreciate it. They'll probably put it in their home as a decorative piece, or maybe they'll put a bulb in it, or I don't know, do something cool with it. Bam, again, Diamond Strike Fire. These, this is a two pack. I bought these for about, I think they were $6 each. Sold them for $40.79 free shipping and it took eight months to sell. Not that it took the whole eight months to sell these, but I've been selling these consistently. I actually bought a box full, a huge box full. So these sell throughout the entire year, especially during the cold season. They start selling a lot because people just wanna strike it and, and turn on their <clears throat> barbecue pits, or if they have a chimney inside, they use these as well. Football season is here, so of course, football hats always move. This is the, the Indianapolis Colts. I got this hat for six bucks, sold it for $16.82, $4.99 shipping, and it only took 22 days. I'm almost at the end of my railroad purchase or my train purchase. This is the Tech 11 Railmaster. This is a transformer. You use it to power up, power up the trains, plug this in. It's in working condition. I got this essentially because this came in a big pack of other things, right? So once I pieced them out, basically I paid a dollar for this, sold it for $20, $15 shipping, and it only took four days to sell. Everybody knows what this is. This is an Apple Watch, 41 millimeter with a brand new band. Um, technically not brand new because I used it, uh, I used it for maybe a week and a half. Comes with this, 41 millimeter series seven. I got this at a pawn shop for only $70. I decided to wear it for about a week, maybe two, I, I think it was about two weeks just to see what all the fuss was about with Apple Watches. And I personally don't like it because it's another thing that the government can use to track me on my wrist and send sig signals and impulses and stuff. And I just don't like it. So I said, you know what? I'm gonna get rid of it. Sold this for $169.99, $20 shipping. Uh, like I said, I paid $70 and it took only two days to sell. Bam, on speakers. You can get these, especially after season, meaning uh, every three months or every quarter or so, they call it a season sort of, and they start marking these down. I purchased these for six bucks, sold them for $27.50 free shipping on these, but I actually had a bunch of other on speakers that I've been selling for the last eight months. They sell consistently. People now know on they don't know it as a walmart brand they know it as a good brand therefore they start buying them and paying up for these even amazon has these now and i know because i have them on amazon too not this one specifically but other ones i have them and you can get gobs of money for these this is fun willy wonka uh willy wonka bar it's one boxer brief in here happy boxer makes a ton of different underwear slash boxer types like this um, different brands, different themes. And this one I bought for $2.50, sold it for $16.14 free shipping, and it only took six months. 
I actually sold, I think this is my fifth one. Halloween is coming, so of course these are gonna move. Especially goosebumps. Goosebumps are coming back in full force. T-shirts, hats, whatever you can find in Goosebumps, it's pretty much, it's a guaranteed sale. And this is all year round. Obviously, it's going to sell faster when it is closer to Christmas, uh, to Halloween. But these do sell year round. I got this for $6.99. I, I sold it for $16.99, $4.99 shipping. And it only took 11 days. For those of you that have long hair, look at this. This is called a, this is a Maxius flat iron, but it also has a steamer. This iron is highly sought after because of this. I've never used anything like this on my hair, and I do have very long hair. But uh, I know that people want it, and I know that it works really well. So I bought it. I snatched it up as soon as I got there. I think it was at Goodwill, and I rarely shop at Goodwill. But I went to Goodwill, and I found this for 3 bucks. Sold it for $36, $9.99 shipping, and it only took four days. For those of you that don't know, that is the True Religion brand. True Religion used to be a very, very high-end brand. The brand has stepped down a little bit from, from their heyday, but it still sells well. I got this for $9.99, sold it for $24.64, free shipping, and this is considered or called a newsboy hat. I've sold, I think this is the fourth one, and most of these, for whatever reason, go international. This one's going this one's going here to to the US, but most of the other ones were international shipping. Ah, uh, these are super cool. They're made of brass. They're made in Korea. These are pheasants or whatever you want to call them. Some people call them different things online, but I know that they're pheasants because I can see them right here. It's a pack of 3, the the big, the medium and the small. I sold these for 24.29, 9.99 shipping, and it took 2 weeks to sell. And I didn't even pay for these. My mom actually bought these a while ago and then i was at i was at home i was visiting her and she said oh hey you know i got this these little pheasants if you want to take them and sell them and i said hells yeah so there you go thanks mom gracias por los pajaritos de brazo ma i don't know if you can see the whole thing but this is a black banana republic leather genuine leather jacket i got this at a thrift store at a hospice thrift store at my favorite thrift store i did pay up for this but I said, I don't care because I knew it was going to go. They had just put it out. I got it for, I bought it for 20 bucks. I took an offer on this for $54, $14.99 shipping. And it only took five days to sell. This is a three pack of Christian crosses that I purchased from Mexico. Pewter is one of my staple products. I buy it from Mexico all the time. All different kinds of pewter, especially these, they do well. And closer to Christmas season, they start moving a lot better. I took an offer on these. $25, $9.99 shipping, and I paid $12 for these three. And it took me one month to sell. This is one of my favorite things to sell. This is MCM glass for home decor. It's a, it's a lamp. I actually wanted to put this in my living room, but it was sitting there for a while, and I just never got to it until I said, you know what, I'm just going to sell it let somebody else have it. MCM or mid-century modern, meaning the, the home decor that is post-World War II, to about early 60s, late 50s is considered MCM or mid-century modern. MCM sells extremely well. It's coming back in full force to homes everywhere in the US and everywhere else in the world. So when you find it, get it. I paid five bucks for this because the lady just wanted to get rid of them. I ha actually have two. There's a white one with uh, orange and brown, I think. I sold this for $52, $24.99 shipping, and it sold in three hours. This was my fault because I sold similar from the, the white one that I had that hasn't sold in about three months. I had never put this one up because, like I said, I wanted to keep it. But this, I know I should have I should have put it up for at least 100 because of the green. Whenever you find MCM green, like this light green tintish color, trust me, just ask for more money. It will always sell for more money because of the green. It is highly sought after. It is now getting more and more rare to find. So you can set the market. You can set your own price for this. Like I said, this was a mistake because I sold similar and I just, I, I forgot to change the price. But within, come on, within three hours, it sold like that, 52 bucks. And it's only going about, <laughs> I think it's about 25 miles away from, from where I'm at. This is where I'm shipping it. So if... 
if this person gets to see it, if the person that bought this gets to see this video, you know what? Take care of this. Enjoy it. I love it. One of my favorite pieces that I've ever purchased. That was it for this week. Thank you very much for joining me for another video in this series of What Sold. If these videos are helpful, leave a comment down below. Hit the like button, subscribe, and do all that kind of stuff because, as you know, it does help the channel. And I will see you on the next one. Peace!